Hi guys, welcome back to the Willow Pink channel. Today, I'm going to be reading you the book, Just the Two of Us. Written by Sarah Cathy. Just the two of us. Some animals on the side. You can have this as a bedside. Bedtime story. Jasper and his mum lived in a cute little house with a great big backyard where they loved to play on sunny days. Jasper enjoyed playing with his puppy while his mum planted some beautiful new flowers. Even the chicken joined their game. On Saturday morning, Jasper played soccer with his friends. Each week, a mum or dad would take their turn to set up the game and bring fruit for the half time break. Jasper's mum never missed a game and always cheered the, cheered the loudest. Jasper and his mum loved to take holidays at the beach. This year they went snorkeling on the Great Barrier Reef. Barrier Reef. Jasper was very brave and enjoyed exploring in the ocean. The colourful coral and fish were so beautiful. Were so beautiful. Jasper loved the adventures he had with his mum. One day after school, Jasper watched his best friend Patrick as his dad scooped him up and swung him high above his head on the way to their car. Jasper smiled as Patrick, Patrick squirreled weakly and he started to wonder why he didn't have a daddy to swim him to swing him up high like that. Jasper's next door neighbour Jamie had a really Cheeky daddy who liked to play tricks on them when they were playing. Jasper thought Jamie's dad was so funny and wondered what it would be like to live with a daddy who was so cheeky. One day, when Jasper's mum picked him up from school, Jasper said, Mum, we don't have a daddy. Jasper, Jasper, darling, his mum said gently, you are right, 
there is no daddy in our home. But you know, all families are beautiful and different. And in our family, it's you and me. Just when his mum met some, met some friends down by the lake to have a picnic and watch the fireworks. Jasper noticed that so many of his friends had different and interesting families. Ha ha and Eliza didn't have a daddy either. They had two mums instead. Adam, Callum and Marcus didn't have a mummy or a daddy. They lived with their grandparents who they called Oma and Opa. Jasper was beginning to think his mum was right. Maybe all families are beautiful. Rocky's enjoying the story, yep, isn't he? Yep. <laughs> Jasper liked the idea that his family was, spe was special, but he still wanted to know one thing. Mum, why don't I have a daddy? He asked. Jasper, darling, his mum replied as he as she kissed him gently on the forehead. Before you came into my life, I was all alone. There was no daddy in my home. I was so sad without you. Then a kind donor said we would help me become your mum. He said that all families are beautiful and different and that our family could be you and me just the two of us overheard patrick ask jasper where's your daddy she watched as jasper jumped right in we don't have a daddy in our home, but that's okay. All families are beautiful and different. And in my family, it's mummy and me. Just two of us. Jasper, Jasper smiled up at his mum. Later that night, as Jasper and his mum enjoyed a good night cuddle, she asked, Jasper, darling, do you mind very much 
that you don't have a daddy. Just the thought about it for a moment. Mum, I love you much more than I then I mind not having a daddy in our home. All families are beautiful and different and I and in our family it's you and me, just the two of us. Families are different. You enjoyed the book. Bye.